Another thing that I wanted to point out is how I use setups for this child. Like, remember um, to make your sound to smile when you make this sound. Um, I use shadowing. So when the child is, is responding and is imitating me, I'm shadowing him to give him that visual support. Also using physical prompts to help him um, be able to produce the sound correctly. So we want to do as much as we can to support the child in being successful. And this is some of what we talked about in the target selection course and, and not shying away from using or selecting more challenging targets. Um, but if we do choose more challenging targets, it means that we need to work harder to support the child in being successful, that we need to provide rich and supportive context, and then they can be successful.